So, what happened to Zinolinsky? Uh, nothing happened. He's around. He, he just released an album. You know what? I, I said I was done with album reviews three albums ago. But look at me here doing another album review. Wow. Now this time, this is the last time, I promise. So the guy with the most rays in Nigeria, able to pull girls with his baby looking face. Zeno. I saw us, uh, trust me, trust me. So I got to know Zeno through this song. Yo, that song was on repeat all the time. Well, guys, he just released an album. Great and last. More like giving us a beautiful way to end the year. You know what? Zeno looks like a cool, calm, collected, quiet boy. Now let's see what his music tells the same story. Alright, alright, you know how we do it here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's... Zeno, great, and let's go. Whoosh! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. First of all, <laughs> I like it. That band was special. Oh, no, no, Okay, so first of all, there's one thing in the song that I found uh, quite. I'll just say the word fake. <laughs> People want me. I, I found quite interesting. You know, if you listen to the beginning, listen. Okay, so that thing there, uh, I'd like to call it a reverse sound, right? So guys, I've said this before. Every normal instrument is supposed to have the amplitude at the beginning and then it fades down. You understand? So now let me play a normal piano for you to hear. Now let me reverse it. Okay, first of all, there are a lot of things happening in the song. There's something I like to call ambience. Guys, when somebody says ambience, just like you're in a space, there are a lot of things surrounding you. You, you get what I mean? Guys, you see that thing there? That is the bass synth, right? Guys, we have the normal synth and we have the bass synth. And that particular synth, I think it's called a fat bass synth. So those are the things that fancied me in this particular song. Only God fear award me. All I need is prayer for my daddy. Okay. 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 Guys, that particular thing we call it a pizzicato, right? You hear that it's being plugged. Something's being plugged. But I'm also hearing a staccato inside too. And guys, a staccato is when you short short nose, right? Medua, uh, uh, you don't want to know what your name means in three years, trust me. See that EP inside the song. Ah, guys, that's just one thing I found in the beginning. You know, you give me vibe on vibe. Anytime you come on, you hear it? Give me back some va. Yes, that thing is called a pre delay. And guys, that effect is on a reverb, right? So, this is a reverb effect, and that's the pre delay. When you turn it up, it does yes. this. Are you hearing that thing inside the song? Guys, that thing we call it a jazz guitar. There are normal guitars, but a jazz guitar has a peculiar sound, right? A clean guitar sounds basically like this. Now a jazz guitar sounds like this. The jazz sounds more dampened. I know the key center. I'll keep it to myself. I record music instead. There's also one thing I'm noticing in the song. Leave listen, listen, listen. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come. You hear it? That thing is called, <laughs> I'll pronounce it wrongly, but it's an Asian instrument, right? This is this is how it looks like. And this is how it sounds like. Medua, Medua, Okay. We've sent us to the armor piano. Let's listen what they have to offer. Yeah. Three hear that thing, right? That thing is called a two five one progression. Two, 
I'm sorry for the banana. You listen to the kick, you see that it's pa, pa, pa. It's not ta 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 Oh, I like the way there are a lot of things in the song, but they are not overshadowing each other. Again, let's go. Yeah. Okay, so guys, that thing, that's how a fella song with Sana. That's how a fella will play his instrument. I like the way they use the log drums and the hammer piano inside this one. There's something peculiar about the song at the end that I want you guys to note. Okay, guys, that thing is called a vocoda. It's a very, very peculiar effect that, if done well, it makes the song feel robotic and nice. So, guys, a vocoda, let me say, just like a trumpet, right? I am the input. I input into the trumpet, right? And then the trumpet is the, the carrier and it's like makes the voice. The trumpet is the one that modulates the voice and sends it into frequency bands. You get me? One of the most popular vocoders out there is the vocal synth. Complicated, but yeah, I see my voice in vocoder form. Ooh. Oh, my life. I'm trying to understand. Okay. First of all, those kind of progression, that chord that a young John is using, I like to call it the dreamy chord progression. When you play it or when you hear it, you feel like you're in La La Land. You're in a, like, oh my god, magical place. Yo, oh my life. I'm trying to understand. I like the way the beat is punchy and it's one one. Ah. Oh my god, oh my god. Young John. How are you feeling right now? When you listen to this particular song, how are you feeling? See the violin inside the song. Ah. <laughs> Calm down. Almost every instrumentation I hear, they don't go without the shakers. It's like every producer just sat down and agreed that me, everybody, we have to use shakers no matter what. I hear that shaker is fire. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, the little details, the little details. <laughs> I know I've not said anything about the lyrics. Come on, I'm not learning the language, man. First of all, guys, that is a mute guitar. Secondly, I think he's playing in the pentatonic scale, right? Guys, this is what the pentatonic scale looks like. Right? That's the easiest scale to play. I like this rhythm. Listen to the guitar. Oh my god. When you listen carefully, you see that the guitar too has a slide. Queen gets a queen. Ira, 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 let's go. Guys, she's my favorite female musician at the moment. I quit Tonyum. I told you. That's something she does. Oh, oh, no. Rest is also important, though. You know, you know. Well, it depends on my mood, yeah. It's very, very, very long. Oh, Guys, you see, I seen that this thing Zeno likes to do it a lot. Singing one key and singing another octave. One way you can do it is through a pitch correction software if you don't want to do it the normal way. You just sing a normal voice and the pitch correction software send it to plus 12. You get me? Okay. Guys, do you hear that? Do you hear that? I think that's what we call a guitar slide, right? We have the bass slide and we have the guitar slide, right? And that sound comes out when there's a friction between your hands and then the strings. You get me? I've been trying to focus. Jeez. Don't nobody know us. Give me love and no cost. Say the EP. You feel it. It's like two on my left. Like it when I can jump. Like it's a young pastor. Like it's a young pastor. See the way he entered inside the song. If he's the bounce inside. I, I always talk about the bounce in the song. I find those things peculiar. You get me? Let's go. Me how you come down. When it's you got your love out. That's what we call a staccato. You see the way it was just one, 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 one strike. You get me? Two, two, two. Now, you see what I'm saying. Zeno likes to do that a lot in almost all the songs. I can bet the next song is going to be like that. I think that's his style. Oh, 
little few, I'm blessed. I don't wanna be by myself, cause I'm a mess without you. Yeah, there's drinks inside this song. Yeah, there's drinks. Okay, 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 okay. Did you hear that? Okay, so now these are the kind of things I found peculiar in this particular song. Okay. okay. But I think the beginning is kind of like a sax and, and like strings and then a trumpet. I'm here kind of like trumpet. I'm here kind of sax. I'm here kind of like strings. Do you hear it? Yeah, okay, so now that thing you had there is a muted guitar, you know that. Now I just want to marry my designer. Okay. Take your party. Okay, so now they are using the melody that they used to begin the song. That is basically like the chorus of the song. Then let's go. I've been inside playing Call of Duty. I've been playing Call of Duty. Okay, I, I don't understand. Yeah, I've still learned. Okay. That's that the most iconic Ama piano intro I've heard. You see the way they control the pitch in that, um, I don't know what it's called, a riser. That is all pitch control, you get. Maybe let's do that. Maybe if you come, you come to me. You hear that? That one was a riser, was a holo riser. Oh, it was like air. But I don't know how to explain every single detail, but I hope you get me. One, two, three. Never seen a girl like you. We get designed. You hear it inside the song again, right? Octave. Uh, that's it. Let's go. Keep on popping, keep on rocking. Okay, wait, first of all, I like how it's playing with the string. Boom, boom, boom. It's off beat, but it's on beat. Yeah, all the girls on my neck like that. But I'm sorry, I no get that time. Feel like I got them. Okay, wait, so this song is kind of like a calm song. He's just speaking his mind, I, I guess. <laughs> On the track. Okay, okay. We're done. We're done. Ooh, what an album, man. See the way I'm sweating. God damn it. You know what? I'm impressed. My favorite songs on this album are Odinaka and Many Worlds. Wow, Zeno gave us a calm, chill way to end the year. Well, I don't have much to say. All I have to say is Happy Holidays. Many